from robots to laptops, our one class at a time crew has been making a difference at local schools. Time now to take a look back over the past year. Davis. <laughs> well, good morning, Mrs. Good morning. Stevens. Apologize to interrupt everybody. Good morning, kids. How are you? On behalf of First Interstate Bank and KBZK, we'd like to present you with this check for $250 to purchase robots um, to help your students learn coding. Why nonfiction books? Well, we're at a stage of life where we just want to know about everything in the world and most of my library is just fiction books and so it'd be really great for them to be able to find things that they want to learn and be able to read those things for themselves. What, what is an escape box? The escape box contains clues. The students have to go around the classroom and they have to find things and work together as a team to solve problems. And so our last one that we did was factors and multiples. And so they had to know what factors and multiples were in order to solve the problems to get the code to get out the box. They are globes that have a game on the bottom that um, help kids practice geography and location and um, finding a bunch of things around the earth and just ask them questions and it's set up in a game format so it's a little more fun. So we've got probably 40 or 50 school owned instruments and a lot of these instruments uh, need materials to keep them in good shape, swabs and oil and things like that. Um, and so this is this money will go towards getting those materials so students don't have to pay for that out of their pockets. The light box kind of draws kids in because it's pretty interesting and fun for them. So my idea was to get the light box, kind of get everybody together in a group, learn some pre-academic skills and learn about science and how the light works with um, different materials. So our kids do a lot of assignments on Google Classroom and we um, unfortunately, we don't have one-to-one -one, uh, Chromebooks in our classroom, so we use what we can, and so this will definitely help, you know, one more Chromebook so that kiddos are able to do their writing assignments and turn them into me. Awesome. Are you excited about this? I am. <laughs> yes, awesome. thank you very much. So we're trying to introduce the kids into uh, programming, writing code on computers, and then to make robots, uh, devices of basically any type. Well, the fantastic elastic brain is all about how the brain can change, and that even though maybe you aren't good at something yet, mm -hmm. the more you work on it and the more you practice, then you can excel at it later. So it's all about becoming a better person and becoming better at school. You know, when I applied for this, I forgot all about this until you just walked in here, but it's going to benefit them because as they all know, I've been collecting these guitars since I was their age um, and we do run into problems with stuff like tuner drops and boom, $20 just disappears like in the blink of an eye and we won't have to worry about that and we can put new strings on these. I am forever. absolutely a fantastic fan of one class at a time. This <laughs> helps us so much as teachers, so thank you. So it's fun for purpose. <laughs> All right, back over to Carson Vicroy with